business groups so far have nothing but praise for the selected members of incoming President Ferdinand Marcos Jr.'s economic team. That includes Pinoy appointee Arsenio Balisacan returning as NEDA chief and former UP President Alfredo Pascual as DTI secretary. He also named BSP Governor Ben Jokno as Finance Secretary, with BSP Board Member Felipe Medalla succeeding his post. It's an A-team. They're all tried and tested. I think the business is quite confident about the competence of this new economic team. The Philippine Chamber of Commerce and Industry likewise welcomed Marcos Jr.'s economic managers. They have uh, shown themselves to be competent. The number of years they have devoted to government service has not come up with uh, anything that would question their character. Based on the lineup, the private sector is expecting Marcus Jr. to carry on with policies from previous administrations. I'm sure they realize the continuity is very important, no? but the situation is very fluid. Barcelona said they are waiting for Marcus's appointees in other agencies particularly in agriculture, energy, and tourism. But for UP School of Economics Assistant Professor J.C. Punong Bayan, the Marcos administration will have to face some critical tasks ahead. The economy that uh, President Duterte inherited back in 2016 is very much different from the economy that Marcos Jr. is inheriting right now. Aside from inflation, still waiting to be announced is Marcos Jr.'s pick for the Budget Department. Mobile journalist Pamela Vasquez, we are One News.